one game. <laughs> What's fun about it? You walk in one direction, you just. Whatever <laughs> creature! Welcome back to Shooting Chatters, guys. We are going to continue. Well, at least waited for through. me to put my phone down so I didn't look like a dick. And action! <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna keep I walking promised. through. Okay, so where's this joke you promised us? Yeah, well, on on the last Kirby episode that might not necessarily be airing before this Kirby episode, unless you make sure you do subtle for um, <laughs> <laughs> Well, there's a nice joke. So, okay, so this there's there's a kid. He's probably like eight years old, right? Okay, and he's walking down the side of the road, and he finds a welder's mask. And he puts it on, and he's just like, huh, this is kind of neat. And he opens it and closes it, and he's like, cool. So he starts walking down the street, and uh, he starts hitchhiking so he can get further down the road. And a truck pulls over. This big, creepy old truck driver, right? And he's like, get in. And the kid's like, all right. So the kid gets in, and he's sitting there. Just, they're just driving along. And the... Uh, what was that door? And the, the truck driver looks over at the kid, and he goes, hey, kid, have you ever, ever heard of a... <gasps> There's your gooey girlfriend. <laughs> Make mad love to her. Make mad love to that gooey... Or I could not. To that gooey girl. So anyway, so so uh, he looks over at the kid. He goes, hey, kid, have you ever you ever heard of massage? The kid goes, no. And he, like, plays with the welder's mask a little bit more. And uh, they drive a little further down the street, and the guy goes, have you ever heard of a hand job? The kid opens up the welder's mask, and he goes, no, no, can't say I have. He closes it, and he's sitting there playing with it. They go a little further down the road, and the guy goes, Hey, kid, do you, you know what a pedophile is? And the kid gets all exasperated and opens up the welder's mask. <laughs> he goes, Sir, I gotta be honest with you. I'm not a real welder. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. Wow. Thank you. <laughs> that was dumb. I, I don't know why I laughed as hard as that. I is. <laughs> it's so stupid. I saved you probably like a good 10 minutes of joke. Guy asks a lot of questions to that kid. <laughs> there was another one I remember my buddy told me uh, a long time ago that was uh, the green golf ball joke. Where this guy, you go through this guy's entire life where you start off, it's like, oh, when he was born, his dad gave him a green golf ball. And when he was like a little, for his birthday, he got green golf balls and Christmas green golf balls. And, and it, you basically go through every milestone and event of this person's life explaining that he gets a green golf ball from his father. And then later on when um, after you've told the joke for like 10 or 15 minutes long um, and th th it gets to the point where the dad's on his deathbed and the kid goes dad what's with all those green golf balls and the dad says come here and the kid leans in and the dad looks and whispers ah! and then he dies <laughs> oh and it's like a 20 minute long joke to give you no punchline because we still don't know Cause the, what the yeah, green cause he golf dies. balls were about he has no idea why that's a dumb joke. It is. I think that thing's invincible. Do you got any sweet jokes? I think the word you're thinking of is invisible. No, I can clearly see it, but you can't kill it. You got any sweet jokes? Not like you. And you'd think I would, because I'm old enough to be a dad that I should have some dad jokes. Wow. But How do you get dragon milk? Cut the cow's legs off. What do you call a cow with no uh, with no left legs? All right. Lean beef. Oh. What do you call what do you call a cow with no legs? Ground beef. Ground beef. Ha 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 ha! Shut up and play Kirby. <laughs> no I'm kidding. Yeah, you're supposed to be angrily speed running Kirby right now. <laughs> <laughs> you don't yeah. have time for jokes. Get mad. Um. So so there's this kid growing up and he loves tractors right and uh he uh he gets uh, all these tractor things when he's born he grows up around tractors he plays with tractors and he gets all these um that rock was hurting you yeah you were supposed to Why? avoid the rock. It, it, to be fair that totally looks like it should be in the background um what does this do it fills all your health yeah oh cool just like it does in smash brothers I. It's an item in Smash Brothers. I did not know that. Yeah. We got to get that tournament going with Kyle. Another time. Why? So, so he can just beat our asses over and over again? Well, I mean, you got to pay extra for that. So, um, 
Yeah, so this kid grows up around tractors, loves tractors, tractor everything. Tractor, 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 right? It's my nephew. What's Dora the Explorer <laughs> doing in this game? Oh, Jesus Christ. It looks like a Chinese Dora the Explorer. It's, uh, Dora, Dora the Explorer. <laughs> I thought you were going to say Explorer, but Explorer. okay. <laughs> Wow, yeah, that, that makes more sense, doesn't it? Yeah, at least at least you you did a racist impression as opposed to just like that's that was fair, as pri privileged white fucking. <laughs> <laughs> broom! You got your broom back. It looks like a flashlight in the picture. Um. Anyway, holy fuck! So this kid loves tractors, tractor everything, right? Tractors his whole life. He has a tractor room. He's got tractor toys. He's got tractor life, right? Anyway, the kid gets older, and uh, and his father... My cousin was like that when and, he was a kid. And his father dies because he was run over by a tractor. And the kid gets really upset, and he takes all his tractor stuff, and he brings it outside, and he burns it in a big pile. And then he gets older, and he goes to his first bar, and he sits down in the seedy bar, and it's all smoky. There's smoke everywhere, right? And, and he sits down at the bar, and he's drinking whiskey, and the bartender says, Oh, I wish there was something I could do about the smoke. And the kid goes, Hold on a second. And he just takes in a deep breath, and all the smoke goes into the kid's mouth and his lungs. And he walks out of the bar, and he breathes all the smoke out, and he comes back in. The bartender says, that's amazing! How'd you do that? And the kid goes, I'm an X-Tractor fan. I don't get wow. it. Wow. <laughs> that's... That's... <laughs> that's so obscure. <laughs> it's just... <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> you still don't get it? I'm so confused. That's okay. I'm gonna go into the second don't, door. Don't explain it to me though, because that'll just ruin it. Okay. Ham Taro! And and Ham Taro's friend. <laughs> cat Taro. <laughs> I was gonna come up with something clever. It's Cat, and that's cat Taro. What came out. I, I'd like to understand what these are for. There must be something you can do in these rooms. So you can see the characters. Are they just like hiding in there? They're like, Yay! oh, all the bad guys are outside. Get, keep them away from me. I fucking hate Yay! this. <laughs> it's so bad. You're I bad. I love every second about this. This is adorable. This is fun. This is neat to watch. This is the best game ever. I'm trying to think about what my go to joke is. Your go to Your joke? life? <gasps> Sorry, I went I there. I think that's Greg's go to that's joke. That's my go to yeah. joke. <laughs> Your life. Uh -huh. It's not true. I have a good life, specifically wife. You have a good is your life, your wife? Uh, wife life. I have a good she wife. Better be. <laughs> I'm I'm sure she has a terrible life because she's married to me. You, she must be amazing. She's a saint. Damn, Alex. I think it's really easy to buy uh, brownie yeah, points boy. with each other's girlfriends and wives, <laughs> um, because they don't have to put up with us individually. They, they just have to put up with one of each yeah, of us. Yeah. I, th I think I, I bought some brownie points with Alex's girlfriend pretty good one day. I remember that. How'd you do uh, that? What? I can't remember. Because um, I called you, and there was no answer. And um, Alex called me back, and he said, yeah, I was in the shower. Katrina watched my phone ring but didn't answer it. And I was like, why didn't she answer it? Like, I, I, she could have been like... Yeah, hey, he's in the shower, yeah, who, and I'd be like, who okay. Dis? New phone. Yeah, yeah. And, and and he's like, yeah, you totally could have answered it. She goes, well, I don't want just some random girl answering his his phone. And um, I said, yeah, I said, do you think I won't know who it is? Of course I'm going to assume it's Katrina answering his phone. She goes, yeah, you better hope random girls aren't answering your phone. And I was like, listen, Katrina, if a girl who wasn't you answered his phone, I'd be calling you next. <laughs> <laughs> Was, to say, have you like, seen Alex? <laughs> <laughs> I can't seem to reach him right now. <laughs> no. I gotta, I gotta keep my boys in check. <laughs> Alex doesn't come across as the type to cheat to me, though. It's because I'm not. And I'm not just saying like that. I'm not just saying that because he's sitting beside me at the moment. Alex doesn't come across as the type to cheat, but I mean, like, he makes fools of us all. <laughs> like, but Mike, so, on the other hand. The way... <laughs> He's sketchy as fuck. No, I'm a giant pussy. <laughs> uh, my wife has always agreed with me when I said that I, you know, she never has to worry about me cheating on her because I'm so antisocial. You never leave the house. I never leave the house. <laughs> so I'm either at work or at home, and she always knows where I am. I mean, that makes 
that actually it's, makes a lot it's of funny sense. and sad it's, all at the it's same cheating time. Cheating on her, that bitch is in the house. No, even then, if it because I no, I don't want people in my house. <laughs> hey, you realize I've only been to Greg's house like once. Yeah. Maybe. Actually, now that I have the Switch, I've been thinking I should invite you guys over and we should have like a party game night. Because one of the games you can get for it is made... If, do you remember the You Don't Know Jack games? I love it. Yeah. 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 It's, it's made by them. Jesus and it's Christ. like the Jack Party Pack. But the best part is you don't have to have like a bunch of the, the Nintendo controllers to play it. Everyone uses their phone. And you download an app and you can play it all on your phone. You can do that with a... There's the Jackbox Party game. That's that you what can it get is. get on Steam. Yeah. But I can get it for the Switch too. I think that you should. I'm no Jessica and I had already said because she and when I showed it to her she's yeah. like oh yeah we're getting that. And I'll taste the cartridge. Plus, plus I eventually want to get Mario Kart and you guys can all come over and play Mario Kart with me. Mario Karty. Mario Kart. What is but the spider game? In like? order for you to play okay. Mario Kart, neat. You have to lick the cartridge first before we play. Okay. We have already done it, so I know. Yeah. But I'm just saying that's that. Anytime we play anything with the Switch, you have to lick the what? cartridge before we play the no, my, game. As soon as you mentioned that, my tongue started, like, getting really... <laughs> uh, when I was a kid... Um, you licked cartridges? No, I... And they didn't taste like I, that? I've been biting my nails since I was, like, five years old, right? Yeah. And I used to be in Taekwondo, and Mom noticed that, like, when I was, like, up to spar with somebody, like, they're, like, throwing kicks and punches, and I'm, like, biting my nails. <laughs> and it was, like... It's a foolproof defense. <laughs> Like, oh, fuck, just, put your, some sort of just put your hands in your mouth. You won't bite your fingers off at all when he kicks you in the jaw. <laughs> anyway, I was thinking more along the lines of the kid's gonna stand there and stare at you and think, "What the fuck is this guy doing?" And then all of a sudden, just in the like, of a fight. <laughs> anyway, so um, suck him up and get his power, or destroy him and all right, ruin and it. get the broom. Yeah, get, yeah, get the. Broom. Do you want a bow and arrow or a broom? And you're just like, I know which one I want. You did well, it I again. Didn't, I didn't even do anything that time. Like literally, it just came out. There, go get him. As most bodily gas does, Alex. Neat. Nothing. That was waste. <laughs> um, go visit your friends. I, th I think you've gotten pretty much everything that you can in terms of... The broom's my favorite still. There's Birdie. I like how it's nice and calm. Is your squishy girlfriend over there? No. no it was Cat Taro, I think. Um... Get your energy drink. But yeah, um, Mom tried. Uh, there was this uh, this bittering agent that you could put on your fingernails. Yep. Li like a nail polish, that tasted just like those Nintendo cartridges, and it's edible, but it tastes like shit. So that you're aware, you're like, ugh, bite my nails. And I fucking I, you toughed it out anyway. I just kept you? going because like. So I'm, wait, when you licked that Nintendo cartridge earlier today, did that bring back flashback memories for you? Weirdly enough, to your yeah. childhood. I mean, like, I still bite my nails now. It's 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 a weird, like, anxiety thing, right? Like, I can't... That's... It's strange that with the anxiety issues that I do have that I never picked up the habit of chewing my nails, especially considering my father chews his nails. Should be lucky. You mean the I should consider myself lucky, or I should just be lucky? Those are, uh, spinning tree nipples. Yeah. Oh Nip my god! They give you nipple power. Did you see what just happened give when you health. absorbed that? That one up just went down. Grab it. Blue, blue. This game's fun. Except for the redwood dicks. They look like big long shafts. For the record, I'm pretty sure any of the enemies that you suck up that don't give you a power, if you push down, it'll give you health instead. I said the ones that don't give you a power. There, bump. I wonder who decided that the Easter Island heads were going to be a like be an enemy, but only if he shoots out other smaller heads of his out of his mouth. Like, well, let, let's be honest. If the Easter Island heads had a power, that would be the power I would picture them having. Really, I would think that they would have monster sneezes because they have giant noses. <laughs> My favorite part about this game is how it, it, we have this like absolutely adorable music. And these cute bright colors and like all this killing forest animals, pastelly shit. looking shit, and then an Easter Island head comes out of the ground and goes, <laughs> like fucking hey, have you, more of me. Could you imagine if they have more of me? <laughs> Make love to that <laughs> sweet squishy girl. The what did you say? What was it? The Make love to that. Make love to that squishy wo squishy no. squishy woman. Make mad love to that squishy woman. Ooh. 
Oh. <gasps> Wispy! It, okay, this is the one I think you have to suck up the apple station. This is the boss. Yeah. If it's the same as the... Yep. You might be able to hurt yep. it with your firepower, though. Yeah. No. No, 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 no. You just gotta, like, stay away from it. There. Him. When he spits out the apple, you have to suck it up and, and spit it back. Carrots, I guess. And rutabagas. And just... There you go. You got this. You can't do the wind, only the vegetables. Yeah, you can't suck wind. You can, but sucking wind does no damage. Just makes you fat. Just you know, makes you feel fat. There. You just found a sweet spot, didn't you? Yeah, I think so. That's cheap. I th no, I think they're slowly getting closer each time he spits one. No, because he's been there for a while. Oh, Whoa, he's angry. Yeah. You pissed him that off. That didn't happen in the Game Boy version. No, this is new. Sick that up. Sick that up. I meant suck, but I can't talk because I'm so excited. Oh, it's those are Kirby. angry carrots, too. He's got angry produce. And angry prunes? Uh, well, all prunes are angry. A lot of this shit does not come from trees. <laughs> that apple looked rotten. Because they're mad. He's mad. He's you were almost dead, too. Do -do 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 oh, the music's the same. Yay! Oh, this is adorable, Alex. We love this. I'm having a great time. When when you're editing this, make sure you zoom in on that face that he's making right there. You made it to level two. You're good at this. The black starfish has one less arm. There's your squishy girlfriend. Make mad love to her. Yeah. Fuck her on the beach. Fuck her in the pussy. <laughs> Whoa, that fish is fucking you. Oh, no, she's oh, fucking she's you. On top oh, no. Of me. It's oh. a threesome. <laughs> Like super did pissed. you enjoy that? Did did did, did I got no did joy you enjoy that? Did you complete? Did I complete? Get your board. oh my god! This music's even better. It's the same. Look at the colors in this do, world. Do, do, do. You tell me that this isn't a beautiful game. And look at that sweeping action. What other game could you sweep like that? Cleaning mama. <laughs> Is that a real game? No, cooking mama. I think they made a gardening mama too, but yeah. Oh, you know what game we need to play for the show? What? That farming simulator. Yeah. Did you know that the, um, I think there's a train simulator? Yes, there is. 2000 or something? And, uh, if you buy all of the extras and DLCs in it, it costs over $7,000. I can believe it. Wow. There's people that That's get into it. That's how many DLCs there are. I think it's the same for, like, the flight simulators. Yep. Oh, you did. I couldn't imagine a simulator that's stuck to a fixed track, though. <laughs> yeah, at this least, is at incredible. Least, at least with the flying simulator, you can like fly around, go where you want. But mm -hmm. yeah, a train. You could even commit like a like a kamikaze. Like. The only people I could see wanting to play train simulators are people like Sheldon from The Big Bang Theory. I don't watch that. Show. So there's a there's a flight there's a guy on YouTube who does flight simulator stuff. Um, you know he's he's an actual pilot. Yeah, and he uh, he like trolls as the uh, as a, like an air traffic controller in the in the air in the simulator games, yeah. and he uh, like Aww, he'll, he'll be... a little bird. Meh. Why is that bird so close to that cat and not getting eaten? And he'll he'll go he'll be like super serious, and, like super world. professional, as if he's an air traffic controller, and the other players just don't know what to do because he's like he's like uh, Alpha Mike, Alpha Limo. Lima, uh, you're can clear. You, uh, <laughs> can, can you uh, can you give me your uh, your current bearing? He's like, uh, what's your twenty? He's like, <laughs> he, like the guy's like uh, left. He's like, well, I don't know what the fuck you mean by left because that's not a bearing. But uh, uh, I'm gonna assume that you mean like ninety degrees, hundred eighty degrees, two hundred seventy degrees. It's just so dry. Like the humans. Try to just go down so the dry. hill as the rock. You can roll down the hill, Alex. You can rock and Why roll. have you not been doing this before? Play, What's I under play, the water? Because back, I play go back, good games. Go back, go back, go back. He, he go can back. rock and roll. Go under the water. I'm just going to sit here as a rock. You, nobody wants Fucking to... Fucking riveting! Nobody watches our show to watch you just lay there as a rock. Yeah, they watch our show to watch Greg lay here as a rock while we play games. I was going to say the only one that watches you lay there as a rock is your girlfriend, but... Oh, rock hard. Am I right? <laughs> Give it up for my boy. Bump my Do fist. It. Do it. We're talking about your erections. <laughs> it's not awkward at all. I am so hurt. Now you're right going to get double sweeped. Get your broom back. Get rid of the rock. 
Yeah, I don't know, like, yeah, trying to talk about, like, professionalism. My boss was talking about some positive changes he wanted to make to, like, our on-call that we're doing. And I think halfway through his explanation of the changes he wanted to make, I was like, John, stop. I can only get so hard. <laughs> and everybody, so And everybody in the room is like, Mike? Like, <laughs> you're at work? <laughs> you're like, ah, too soon? <laughs> and I'm just like, I don't even care, like, at that point. Oh my god. So, I realized uh, earlier this summer that we should probably, should probably... We can't do it now, of course, but... I want to do one of those, uh, you know, three guys in a hot car type type videos. My, what, how is that different from what we're doing right now? That's yeah, the thing. Right, and it's fun. reminding me of it right um, now because I am well, so fucking sweaty. Have you guys seen that video where the guy's like, man sits inside hot car to prove that dogs and babies are cowards? <clears throat> and like he's sitting there and he's, dies. and he's like... <laughs> Didn't and he, he pass out? No. He's like, he's sitting there and he's just like, it's a little hot, a little sweaty, nothing I can't handle. He's like, a baby would be dead by now. Fucking babies are stupid. And then he's like sitting there. He's like, oh, what's this? This is a carrot stick. I'm just eating some carrot sticks because my teeth won't break under the pressure of eating a carrot. Not like a stupid fucking baby. I, I must admit, I've never seen that. The the sarcasm behind it is like you have to have the right mindset to watch it. Otherwise, it's just offensive as hell, right? True. Yeah. I ate. Dude. Oh, get in me. He totally <laughs> just spit you out. Oh, yes, get in my gooey belly. <laughs> yeah. I like how everything's a waffle cone. <gasps> He's going to shoot you. Oh, my God. You got that at the last minute and survived because that would have killed you. Well, you should try uh, speed running through the level now that you're invincible. Yeah, just run. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> the thing he's been complaining about not being able to do this whole he time. He finally can, and then he just, like, oh, I'm just gonna. I didn't mean I'm gonna stand in this, far, and he I'm gonna stand in this one spot. Well, I'm glad you came to the end here. This is, like, a perfect time. Yeah. Oh, he's sad. Stop. Oh, what are you gonna see. get? What are you gonna get? What are you gonna get? That was useless. Wow, ending on a high note. You got the troll rock. Thanks for watching that episode of Shoots and Chatters where we got the troll rock. Alex ran. Kinda. This is nice. We should we should continue this. I hate you. Are we gonna continue? This? We're gonna continue this game. This We're saving awful. this. I'm all about this. Alex, you're you're beating this game. See you next time. Got it, guys.